All right, so it's time to wrap up the updates on Sheila's therapies and her journey with her naturopath. So stick around. Hi everyone, and Ashley here from Sheila's Voice. Welcome back to our channel. If you are a returning subscriber, we welcome you back. We love you and we appreciate you. If you are brand new here, thank you for stopping by. My name is Anasha. Our channel is about our daughter, Shayla, who was diagnosed with autism uh, just shy of three years old. Uh, Shayla is now 10 years old. She's a beautiful young lady. She's doing great. Uh, she's in school. She's doing her therapies. Uh, she's thriving in her own way. So if you want to hear more, if you want to see more about our journey with Shayla, feel free to hit that subscribe button. So I am going to wrap up in this video. Um, I'm just going to wrap up the whole updates on Shayla in regards to her therapies, her journey with a naturopath. So the previous video I spoke about therapy. So in this video, I am going to touch base on her journey with a naturopath. So a few months ago, and I will link the original video of the OTSAS, a few months ago, we decided to reach out to a naturopath. It's something that we had done very early on in, in Sheila's life. Uh, we worked with a naturopath, um, but we just decided recently just to revisit that avenue. So I reached out to a naturopath, and we spoke about Sheila's uh, life, uh, where she is right now, her what she can do, what she can't do, and so on and so forth. So the first thing we did um, was do an OATS test. It's a OATS test, O A T. Yes, organic acids test. Um, so that basically was a urine sample that we needed to collect and send in. And what they did, they basically tested for vitamins, uh, bacteria, all the good stuff, you know, all the good stuff that they test for. So we did that. Um, yes, it was a challenge to get the urine sample, but we did. Yay. And <laughs> so we were able to send that in. Um, we did that and the results came back and it was like a gazillion pages, um, but the doctor went through everything with us, and what we found was, yes, there was tons of bacteria, as well as um, her vitamins were low, so her vitamin Bs in particular were really low, um, bacteria, there was high bacteria, low um, vitamin. Overall, the test results came back really, really, really well. Um, I was actually surprised that it wasn't a little bit worse. Um, it was really, really, really good. In regards to the vitamins, it's not that she, um, we just, we figured out, it's not that she wasn't getting it because she was eating a lot of, uh, she, she eats healthy overall, but because of the immense bacteria and the other things that we found um because of that being there um the body is not absorbing the vitamins and the good stuff that it needs it's not doing it in the in the in the proper manner um because all these other things are in play right so um the first thing we did was put a plan together what are we going to do to get the bacteria level down the vitamin level up whatever, balance everything up. So the first thing, I think even before we did the old test, when we first reached out to the naturopath, we started on, um, because Shayla had intense constipation, um, we started on um, probiotics. So based on when we started the probiotics and based on when the test results came in, we had not seen an improvement in anything. Um, so we definitely needed the, the test results so we can dive deeper into what the issues were. So since the test results came back, we started a few things. So we continued on the probiotics, as well as we started uh, vitamin B12 shots, as well as we started um, other vitamin B uh, supplements in the form of a capsule. And uh, we did as well, um, oh God, now I forgot, something else to help with the constipation. And I'll leave it below. I forgot, but this is it below. Um, to help with the with the constipation. Uh, we have seen a huge, huge, huge improvement in regards to her constipation. Shayla goes to the washroom like it's nothing now. Um, when we were constipated, it would be like a week or more before Sheila went to the washroom. And when she did want to go to the washroom, she would hurt. She would strain. She would cry. It would take days for the one to, for her to be able to ease herself. So that was so hard to watch and to see. Um, but I'm so grateful that we, we did what we did and, and that's been improved. And another thing I think that caused that was um, the inulin from the Nemechek protocol. And I spoke about that in another video. I'll leave the link below. But I think that contributed to her constipation. But what 
whatever the naturopath has put in place right now that has worked in tremendously. Another thing that um, um, I should have mentioned first that we did was we changed the way she eats. So we cut out dairy, we cut out wheat, we cut out uh, grains, and we cut out added sugar. So Shayla now drinks uh, basically um, almond milk, um, coconut milk, and cashew milk. So these are the milks that she drinks. She has no issues with it. She drinks it like it's nothing. Um, in regards to her foods, her pasta and stuff, um, we do um, quinoa pasta, lentil pasta, and so on and so forth, like zucchini pasta. Um, in regards to her, her fruits, a lot, a lot of uh, fresh fruits, uh, vegetables, a lot of vegetables. So she has transitioned so well uh, to these foods uh there was no complaints there was there was nothing it's like nothing ever changed because Sheila loves her food anyways so it's like nothing ever changed so we transitioned to this um healthy eating and it helps us as a family as well we've all transitioned to this lifestyle in, in regards to eating healthier so that's a pro for our entire family so that I think in addition to the probiotics and um the other little things that we were doing that we definitely see a huge improvement in regards to her bowel movement. Um, the vitamin B12, um, we had some hit and misses with that, um, but we are on vitamin B12 where she does, uh, we do a needle, uh, we do a needle every other night, um, and that is supposed to help reduce the the stims and the and so on and so forth. It's also help improve in her um, in her language. Um, we've not seen a much improvement there. Um, we will continue to use it, but we've not seen much improvement here. I actually have a checkup with the with the naturopath soon to talk about to talk about that to see what next we can do to help. But we've not seen uh, anything significant to actually talk about. Uh, on that level, but in regards to her eating and in regards to her going to the washroom, which was huge, uh, we've definitely seen some huge improvements there. So that's pretty much it in regards to our journey with the naturopath. I will continue to keep you guys up to date as to what we are doing, uh, what we have done and the progress that we've seen. But so far, um, it's been a positive journey. Uh, we were on natural supplements. Um, her, her diet has uh, changed. Uh, she's a lot healthier. Um, her, we've even seen a weight improvement with uh, the diet change as well. It's, it's weird, but <laughs> um, we've seen some weight improvement. Because Sheila's always been so tiny, uh, but we've definitely seen her starting to full up. Um, she's so tall. She, like, she grows tall, and she stays like this. Uh, but we've definitely seen her starting to fill up a little bit in regards to weight. Um, again, I am overjoyed that she can now go to the washroom um, okay. Um, I'm thrilled about that. Uh, but overall, um, we will continue to work with the naturopath, and we will definitely keep you guys updated. So if you guys have any suggestions, uh, any comments, any concerns, again, we're open to hearing from you guys. We're open to feedback. Leave it below in the description box, and we'll definitely reach out to you. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for sticking around and for listening to me. Blah, blah. I'm sharing about Sheila, and I know you guys like hearing about Sheila, okay? But I appreciate you guys. Uh, if you haven't already done so, feel free to like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. When new videos get uploaded, you will be one of the first people to know. We will see you soon. Take care.